right now if you're from Philly you're already ultra excited because you know last night on television the NLCS was on and the Philadelphia Phillies have already clinched game five after going to the World Series for the second year in a row now just if you were not there which most of Philadelphia already were you would understand how crazy Broad Street was last night let me show you a little bit if you weren't there So, if anybody doesn't realize right now, saying, Kurt, why are you in the shower right now? What the fuck are you so excited for? Well, it's probably because Cliff Lee decided that after we win the NLCS, that he would go over to 15th and Market for Models and start signing autographs. For those of you who already don't know, in the pro season, Cliff Lee right now is 3 0. Two wins against the Rockies and one against LA. Not to mention that the one against LA was a no hitter. Or not a no-hitter, I'm sorry, I don't know why I said that. A uh, scoreless game and went all the way to the ninth. So just to put it in plain terms, Cliff Lee honestly could be one of our very big lineup starting pitchers. And I'm going to get his autograph. You wait, you watch. Yo, can you hear me? Can you hear me? Yeah, or, or what's it called? Are you are you there yet? I'm on a uh, 15 and Rich. I'm walking in now. Alright, cool. Alright, what's it called? I'm going to come out right now. I'm taking a subway. Alright. Alright, bye. <laughs> so right now we just talked to Odie, here. And uh, he's on his way up too. We should meet him up there. Now usually when I go on the subway, I don't regularly carry my camera. But due to the fact that I was going up to Models anyway, I just happened to catch what was going on in the subway today. <laughs> Not to mention this chick that was staring at me the whole time. Look at her just staring at me like. Somebody hooked him up with a cigarette. I really hope we get on TV. <laughs> yeah, and he's the only closer who's still playing in postseason baseball who hasn't blown a save. And I think going into the playoffs, if you were told any of us. Hey, serious question. I know. Is that, from last is that Trisha talking now? Well, <laughs> <laughs> That's definitely Trisha talking now. That is Trisha talking now. Everybody seems pretty excited. Hey. Hey. How do you throw your change up? <laughs> Cliff Lady. Do you throw me your. Don't shoot your change up? <laughs> Or we could just go to those guys. Just walk up. There he is. The sixth reader. Notice I threw a little woo in there. I'm not gonna lie, I was just excited. All right, folks. We're all here today. Obviously, we know that we know that the Phillies, the Phillies are having a great season. They're in the World Series again. We're here, We're here to help celebrate an unbelievable season. They're back in the World Series, and obviously, it's been such an unbelievable season because of the contributions of the man next to me, Cliff Lee. And and shut the fuck up and just let Cliff Lee talk now. T-shirt. Yeah. yeah. Unveil that shirt. <laughs> Before we continue, can we just let me do my best impression of Cliff Lee during an interview? His last lines may have seriously been the most I've ever heard that man say during this whole process. I'm on board. I hope you sell a million. Now I want everybody to know that this is for the Leukemia um, Foundation or whatever it was that they were doing. They were actually doing this for a really good cause, which I commend them on doing that. So um, I apologize if I act like an asshole the whole time, but 
I just wanted to point that out there before anything, if we go any further on that one. Mind you that anybody at NBC looks like they do not know what they're doing on their job. And just give it up one more time from Trisha. Rose from Leukemia and Lymphoma Society.